August 5, 2013, a historic taste test in London introduces the world's first lab-grown burger. Dutch scientist Mark Post unveils a stem cell-based beef patty grown without killing animals. The goal? Launch a revolution in food production and sustainability. Made from 20,000 muscle fibers grown in petri dishes, the burger cost over $300,000. It was grilled and tasted live by food experts. Though lacking fat, the verdict was promising. Close to meat, but not that juicy. A glimpse at food's future. Funded by Google co-founder Sergey Brin, the event sparked headlines. It proved that real meat could be created in a lab, without livestock. This breakthrough combined biotech, climate advocacy, and innovation in a single burger-shaped bite of global significance. The impact was immediate. Dozens of startups, Mosa Meat, Upside Foods, and more, emerged to improve taste, reduce cost, and scale production. Investors poured in. Lab-grown meat was no longer science fiction. It became a viable path toward ethical, eco-friendly protein. Can meat without animals solve global hunger and climate change? The first lab-grown burger didn't just feed two people. It fed a movement. Would you eat meat made in a lab? Or does the idea still leave you hungry for answers?